I want to talk about a production that's coming back after a long time. And it's like, it's its own thing. But it, I'm talking about Gladiator because Gladiator is yeah! coming back. Gladiator is coming back, everybody, in the form of a sequel. Now, it's been a long time, everybody. But Gladiator came out with, you know, Russell Crowe. It pretty much made his fucking career. I love that fucking movie, by the way. Russell I Crowe. I fucking agree. Crowe, walking phoenix like their 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 dynamic i mean it came out and it was it was huge i mean you think about look looking back at it though it didn't only made like 460 million back then which nowadays we're making billion dollars but that was a different time you know it was a huge they were nominated for 12 academy awards they won five including best picture and and it was it was huge so so ridley scott's like you know what it's time to do a new movie it's only been like a decade let's do another one which it Listen, might make other people's it. career too i'm here for it too here for it i'm really Ron. here for it too Ryan, I was 12 years old when I went and saw that movie with my dad. It's one of my most fondest memories of my childhood, getting to see that movie and watching it on a watching, for me. watching Gladiator on ah. screen and seeing that most memorable scene where he goes, <laughs> my name is Maximus Decimus Marilius, commander of the Legion Armies of the North, <laughs> true, under the true emperor of Marcus Aurelius. My name is I'm a father to a murdered you son, husband he to a murdered to wife, die. and I will have my vengeance in this life or the next. God Damn it, Gladiator is awesome. It still fucking holds. I don't give a shit what anyone says, and I'm here for the fucking sequel. And then Joaquin right. Phoenix puts his thumb down. That that movie made jo Joaquin Phoenix. There would be no Joker without Joaquin Gladiator. A hundred percent. Fucking fight oh, me, bro. Yeah. Fight me. He fucking killed it. He fucking killed it back then. Like that's honestly, I love that movie. And it, you know, it's one of the first movies that clocked in like at three hours long too. You know, so it, so like good. pushing that barrier. And this movie too, they're saying the sequel. It's a sequel. It's a, it's, it's a direct sequel. It's years later. So now we're gonna get into like Maximus's son, but it's not like it's like his half son, I guess. Or it'd have to I know be because it's his a, actual son yeah, was murdered be. in the first yeah, movie. Yeah. So Did you miss yeah, my I know, whole speech about father to a murdered son? Like, I know. God. I mean, so like you know, spoiler alert: Maximus died. In case you haven't seen Gladiator, yeah, um, but yeah, catch up, bro. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, Sabrina. Sabrina. Sabrina has not seen Gladiator by the by by the way. So you know, what? but. But they said that Denzel Washington, Washington is actually signing on for this. Of course, cool. he worked with Ridley back in the day on American Gangster, yeah. but now they're coming together also and they're not the saying Russell what he's Crow. playing. Yeah, yeah, Russell Crowe too. Great actors, no, Justin, great actors. No, hard no to you, sir. Stay watching. Have a good night, Justin. Enjoy. It's a wonderful movie. And it's I want <laughs> You're welcome. Hans Zimmer to do the soundtrack again too because – I'm a soundtrack yeah. guy. Fuck, and fucking yeah. so good. Hey, by the way, so same cinematographer good. from the first one's coming on for this too. Same like cinematographer. The whole crew. It, I, yeah, I, I read, yeah. I read the little thing that you sent me. That it's like the whole goddamn crew. It's like the it's like the crew. whole. I'm excited for this. I it's like everybody's that. coming back. Of course you are. Of course you're excited for yeah. it. This this that's is it. what made me get into what I'm doing now. Gladiator is the reason why I'm here in Los Angeles. You're welcome. Thank you. I mean, look at it. No, you have, no you one, have John you. Matheson coming back as cinematographer. <laughs> you have the production designer Arthur Max coming back. You have the costume designer Janity Yates. So you have like the main heads coming back. You have Ridley Scott in that director's chair too. I mean, it's honestly when I first heard about this, I thought it was gonna be a TV show, and they they kind of like going back and forth, and it became a same. movie. Yeah, yeah. And then it became a movie, and I'm like, I'm like, fuck yeah, a movie's so much better you know yeah, it really but is it makes me nervous because if they're indecisive about what they want the product to be then why do yeah, it but, well hopefully he's been working on this for a long time jake i hope so you know yeah, it's coming out yeah. november 22nd 2024 so it's not that long away paul pascal right. is coming is going to be in it and barry um Ke i can't say his last name keegan uh, who was like the joker in the batman movie he's going to be in it too he's apparently the king in this so he's like the person in charge he's like the fucking main man so he's a walking phoenix pretty much so it's a young cast but i, I wonder i wonder if denzel i wonder if denzel will kind of be like the maximus in a way though too like right. maybe he'll be, be somebody cool. that's you know that has to kind of come back you know yeah. just I, remember I mean, fast jake the frost makes the blade stick <laughs> it does Absolutely, <laughs> it does. For sure. Uh, I love uh, that movie. I Jake, love that fucking movie. Uh, Citizen Skull. Jake. Citizen Skull at Citizen Skull. Jake. What do you think about this? Are you excited about this being a, 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 a direct sequel to Gladiator, or do you think that they should leave Gladiator in the past? Um, that's a hard question. I don't know because the <laughs> I know you said you're worried still, a little bit, right? I am a little bit worried. Well, you said that it was originally going to be a series, right? And, and Originally, like, that, oh. that was a, that was the word. And then they say, "Oh well, maybe let's just do a movie," which means that they're not convinced they have the right 
script. Like, how do they break it up? You know, they're not convinced that they have the right storyline. And all like if 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 they don't know what they want it to be, then I it makes me nervous. But maybe I could be proven wrong. You know, it's I don't know. That's just my initial thought on that. But yeah, I mean, that's that's the way that's that's the reason to worry. It's the reason to worry. It really is. Yeah. I don't really give a shit. Just give me more Gladiator. I've been waiting for <laughs> Copy two that, goddamn right? years. Give me more yeah. Gladiator. Period. <laughs> now, so, let's go to Sabrina for a second. As an outsider here, Sabrina, you you know you you don't you're not a big fan of Russell Crowe, right? This made his career. It made a no, lot of money. It. it was a huge hit for the Academy. What do you think? Do you think that they should do this? Like, you got really got really Scott. You got Denzel. Come on. I mean, no, I, I don't, I, I, I strongly agree with what Lexi said, like, oh, good sequels, you know, from something 20 years ago. And then like, also like a bunch of old men coming to do the same shit that they did 20 years ago. Those are both things that Lexi said. Well, they, I, I they got a new cast. It's like, okay. Rain it in. You asked me my opinion. May I speak? <laughs> Give, her no. floor. Give her the floor, <laughs> Brian. Take it, I Sabrina. Floor. I have, honestly, I have very little to say. So just let me say it. I didn't see the first Gladiator. I loathe Russell Crowe. He is a giant piece of shit. And I don't like to support any of his work. That being said, um, I'm Italian. And I am uh, vaguely interested in the history of what went on at the fucking Coliseum. Um, But after like a certain amount of time went by and like all the hype. And I was just like, I don't want to watch this now. Like, because the expectations get really hot and I'm always disappointed when I have very high expectations and I watch a movie. So I just didn't watch it. And somehow 20 years later, I still haven't fucking seen it. So I'm not excited at all about a sequel. We all know how I feel. Anyone who watches the show knows how I feel about sequels, uh, especially 20 years later or especially like not related or I mean, I don't know. I just if you didn't flesh it out, then why are you coming back to it now? I know it's going to be an all new cast and the, the film crew made an amazing movie the first time. Um, so I guess, you know, give it a shot. I just probably will not be there for it. I think also, Sabrina, because this was a long movie, that's another reason why I didn't want to watch it, like clocking over three hours long. That's a lot for you to yeah, commit your time to that, right? Ago. It was 20 years like ago, I didn't have that problem. It was it's a Batman Returns. <laughs> oh, was, that's a, to, that's me, a yeah. to me, it felt like it was three hours. It's 240. For me now, I'm like, I have a job. I have dogs to feed. I have people to feed. I have things to do. Like To spend three hours on a movie is virtually impossible at this time. 20 years ago, three hours on a movie would have been fine. I probably did that at the bar on St. Patrick's Day somewhere. You know what I mean? So, like, it wasn't that. It was just, like, I didn't watch it right away. Time passed. I hated Russell Crowe. I said, fuck it, I'm not watching this. And, like, all the buzz, all the hype. And then, like, when you watch it, you expect this amazing thing. And then you're like, like, Bridesmaids, great movie. Everyone fucking loved it. They thought it was the funniest, greatest thing of all time. And I'm a woman. I love an all-woman cast. I I watched it, and I was like, I was like, it's It's good. good. It's good. (laughs) But I wasn't doing fucking back handsprings over it. You know what I mean? Like it, it was, it was good. Like it's just what I just I don't. When there's such a high level of buzz about something, it's hard for me to not go in with an expectation, and that was, you know, my issue. Sabrina, that is totally fair. If it makes you feel better, Russell Crowe dies. Yeah, well, that I, might no, make it, it good. Doesn't make me feel better. You know what? I actually, <laughs> I actually, I actually gave like five seconds of not hating Russell Crowe in uh, Thor Ragnarok. I was like, is that fucking Russell Crowe? What? Me too, Titanic he was great in Thor right. Ragnarok. <laughs> or I mean, I mean, uh, Thor Love and Thunder. He was great in Thor Love and Thunder. I laughed my ass off at that shit. Not a giant douchebag. So um, that's you know, but yeah. I still love the douchebag by inside. The way, by the way, I just want to say, Lexi brings up a great point. If you want to get into Gladiator, go back and watch Spartacus, Blood and Sand. It's amazing. That'll get you into the Gladiator movies. And then go watch Gladiator and realize how much better Spartacus actually is. Well, then fuck Gladiator. I'll watch Spartacus. Fuck yeah. Do and speaking it. of pornographic it. type of uh, TV shows and stuff, like it was the Titanic. I just got to see Lucy Lawless's amazing boobitch. Okay. Yeah. Well, I was going to say, I saw Rachel's comment where about like, what about Titanic 2? I'm like, yeah, it's called Titanic Tits. It was in the porn section. That's all I'm saying. Titanic yeah. Tits. Yeah. I, I remember when I was a kid, I saw that shit. So Titanic Tits. That's all Titanic I can say. Tits. Yeah. They had a lot of great porn names back in the day. Remember Edward Penis Hands? Come on. Let's go with it. <laughs> yeah, that's wow. the thing. Is You're welcome, Sabrina. Hands? Yes. Is that where thing. they got the hot dog hands You're from? Yep. Everything yep. everywhere all at once? Yep. Was yep. it from that? Probably so. Probably so. Kind of amazing. It has to be a kind nod. It has to be a nod. 
early but, 90s. But like Jacob you're said, terrible porno, by the way. Terrible porno. I'm horrible. Sure. I, I guarantee it's horrible. But it's like Jacob horrible. said, the, I mean, Gladiator is like two hours and 40 minutes. It's very much like the Dark Knight. There's a Gladiator <laughs> coming soon. Gladiator sequel coming. Get it. Yeah. It's coming. It's coming soon. You got to watch. I mean, I'm going to watch. It, so. I'm here for it. Fucking love you, Denzel. Let's do this.